Hi darling, so now you know why we had to come back from the middle of the show jumping at Liverpool and obviously this has been planned for a while because here I am sat in your favourite chair where you sleep and watch the racing and sport on TV and say, hang on I was watching that while you're snoring. Um, there's a few other people have obviously done bits to, to um, say what they think of you and how you've affected things and, and um, all the marvellous work you've done for the parish walk and other causes on the island. Um, he's one of the most positive people that I know. Um, he, um, he doesn't beat around the bush, you know, he calls a spade a spade. <laughs> so, uh, you know, but that's one of his endearing qualities. Uh, there are countless tales and stories I could tell, but I think uh, very importantly, it would be uh, from the MSP MSPCA's point of view um, to, uh, to really think of, of the years that Ray supported the charity, more than 20 years. He's very hard working, he never stands still. Um, he's irritatingly good at everything. <laughs> Um, but he's always, well, he would always be very supportive and, very, and might help you if you needed it. He looks after all our horses. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he does. <laughs> so here we are in your man shed. And for those of you who think Ray is retired, this is the man shed, which is also full of parish walk stuff. Uh, so he's been sort of in charge of running the parish walk for kind of as long as I can remember. I need to put the signs off and, oh, I'm sorry, I can't make it to dinner. I've got, to, like, a parish walk meeting and it's always, like, ah, oh, hectic. It's just such a big event and so much organisation has to go into it. And it was always one of us would collect it from the attic. So you'd drop a sign down to the attic, which would often land on your head and we'd shout at each other. You know, Ray deserves full credit for everything he does. It's gone from being a fairly small event, a niche event that a few people did, to an event that now um, literally over a 1, thousand, fifteen hundred people take part in on a fairly regular basis. Congratulations. Delighted to hear you've been recognised for your involvement in the Parish Walk, a most unique event. Of course, it's not surprising you've got involved, as the Parish Walk encompasses all that you're interested in, a great athletic endeavour. So, for those of you who don't know, Ray got involved in the Parish Walk 25 years ago. Our eldest daughter was born and had cystic fibrosis, and we wanted to do a fundraiser for CF. And he said, right, I'm going to do the parish walk. Everybody underestimates the amount of time and energy Ray and the other organisers put into it. Um, it's phenomenal. Uh, and without somebody like him, with again, with his energy, it just wouldn't be the same. And long may he continue doing it. And even now in his retirement, he's still as busy as ever. Like, you couldn't tell that he's retired. He's not just lying at home. Obviously, parish walk day is really hard. He's up at the crack of dawn and he doesn't go to bed until the last competitor comes in after 8 a.m., and then today even, like, he was still up again at 10am. Ray is absolutely fantastic. He's an absolutely brilliant vet. He's done so much for the horses. He's absolutely terrific. Um, he's a very loyal person. It's something that he respects in other people as well and, you know, usually stick by you no matter what. You know. He's a great storyteller. Um, definitely likes entertaining, um, making people laugh. Um, and he's definitely always just, I think, wanted the best for us growing up. I would say I am who I am today because of him. If I was not given this opportunity to work under his uh, leadership, probably I would not have been a veterinarian, neither the business owner today. So I think he would sort of feel honoured and pleased, but I think he'd also feel why am I getting this award? You know, anyone could have, you know, other people could have this award. So I think he'd, he'd feel like that as well. So I think he'll be surprised and humbled by, um, you know, all the great things that people uh, say about the parish and the work that he does for, for the parish walk. But I think he will be, be quite surprised. I think he'll probably be, like, fairly mortified. <laughs> Obviously he'd be very surprised, but I've never seen my dad get emotional. I think he'd be quite humbled, actually, yeah. because I don't think he'd be expecting it at all. I just want to take this opportunity to say, thanks, Ray. God bless you. Uh, you're the best man. Um, how do I sum him up in three words? Mm, loyal, hardworking, and driven. Um, determined, uh, intelligent, and caring.
He's very driven, passionate and supportive. Terrific, <coughs> honest and very reliable. Passionate, focused, energetic. A very positive individual. So, fantastic to hear what everybody's had to say about you. Personally, I'm very proud to be your wife. So proud of our four kids, proud of everything we've done, and you're a, you really, really deserve this award. Well, well done, Dad. So, congratulations to you, and I hope you enjoy the evenings. From all the animals at the MSPCA. <laughs> congratulations, Ray, and well done. <laughs> And so you see all of us. <laughs> Congratulations, Ray.